Hey guys, how's it going? RGJ Ron here again, and man, am I having problems. I've been through this part three or four times because my computer kept crashing for some reason. I got the old blue screen of death, and as you all know, that is never a good sign. Never a good sign at all at all. So I'm not gonna act stupid. I know what I have to do around this area. I'm gonna get chased by the monster a few times. And I'm gonna pick up these tinder boxes and some oil that's back here. And this is gonna be a piece of dialogue, but I'm not listening to it again for the fifth or sixth time. Jeez. 2nd of August, 1839. I've arranged for a bed at Der Müller. The village is only, they are dead because of me. Okay. We got that over and done with, and now the monster's gonna appear out here, and I'll have to run my ass back in here. Yeah. Oh shit. Ah, he's not gonna come bursting through that door. He doesn't know I'm here. Seriously, I can never tell where he is half the time. It sounds like he's right behind me, but I know well he's right outside the frickin' door. Okay, see. Okay, he's, he's walking away, doing his thing. Okay, he's disappeared. It's actually the first time I've actually seen him go around the corner before. So far, I, for all I know, he could reappear. Nah. I know where he's going to reappear again. It's going to be up around this area. Ah, uh, jeez. I mean, I know what to expect this time around. So hopefully now the game, or not the game, my computer won't freeze up. Excuse me. Pardon me. I'll go through here. Take a left and take another right. And yep, he is walking around the corner there. Hey, buddy, what are you doing? Well, it's for his own good. Stick out the old lantern here. And read the snow. 3rd of August, 1839. I feel like I have fled the world and all its worries. Alexander, the Baron, is a pig as the sun sets on Brennenberg. It's very. I've read that piece of dialogue before, or I've, uh, or I have listened to it, so I don't need to do the same thing again. Soon we'll be ready. Let there be enough time. Okay. And he's going to appear from somewhere now, from where I do not know. He escaped. Where is he now? Understood. He's going to be outside there. Just try to get a peep. Hello? Yeah, you can all hear him. Oh! Jeez! I didn't realize he was actually in, in that room. He's, I was already in there beforehand, but whenever I heard him, I just turned around and ran. 
So, are you going to do the thing you did last time, bust in this door? not. Shit, well, we've been recording for about five minutes. Jeez. I'm gonna try and sh uh, I'm gonna try and shorten each um, each playthrough, each episode, whatever you want to call them. Because I think 20 minutes is a bit excessive. Okay, it's gone. Ah, uh, shit. Ah, uh, yeah, he's gone. And there's gonna be a few collectibles in this room. Well, a collectible. <sighs> Need to fill up with more oil. And I've plenty of tinder boxes, but I'd rather not use those. Because I really want to stick to the darkness, even though it's detrimental to my sanity, apparently. And what I need now is a glass jar for the acid that was back in the previous room down that away. For a sec. Okay, I'm going to use the old chism. It's not affected by the event. No, I didn't even touch the battle lock yet. No. The years left in the battle lock is in excellent condition. That is jolly. Jolly good. And I was actually here in this room and the game actually froze. Well, not the game, but my computer. Hopefully it won't freeze again. I did the whole virus scan, removed any bad files, unnecessary files, files that were doing harm to my wonderful PC that I only got a few months ago. And at the moment I'm only using onboard graphics, so we'll be playing uh, very high-end games. I was hoping to, do, like I said before, I was hoping to play Resident Evil 4, but that didn't come to life because my PC can't handle its glorious HDness. being chased either. Okay, I think he's gone. Yeah, he is gone. He took a walk somewhere. Jeez, it's terrifying when I hear him because I've no idea which direction he's coming from. This way. Oh, hell. I'm 
hearing a jingly jangly. Some of these being pain. Oh fuck, what was that? I have no idea what that's relating to, but it's obvious. Someone went into a burning house and got arrested for it for some reason. That was brought to Castle Brennenberg. So see, I'm not expecting him. I'm just expecting that low pitch growl any second now. Oh. You're right there, buddy. You okay? Okay, you just chillax there. And oh, oh, jeez, twisted ankle. That looks pain painful. And we're gonna close this door. As I know for a fact, that thing is on board us, burning up the hallway again. The nightmares woke me in the early morning, and for a moment I forgot where I was. Shortly after, there was a knock on my door. Alexander had heard my screams and asked me to join him in the parlour. As we drank our tea, Alexander began to tell me what he knew. It seems like the orb I found casts a long and dark shadow. It's not only a powerful item, but a dangerous one. Simply by touching it, you invoke the powers within, and if you are too weak to control it, it will devour you. The shadow is a sluggish thing, lagging behind the wielder, killing anyone or anything in its path to reclaim the orb. I said I didn't care about its powers and that I should throw it away. Alexander advised against this as I'd still be a part of the path to the orb and eventually suffer death. Having the orb, I would at least have the chance to fight back when the time came. I asked Alexander what he meant when he said he could protect me, and he answered that things can be done, but at a price. Okay, really now, I don't get it. Is that monster chasing us the whole shadow? Is he the shadow that's chasing us? Yeah. Oh shit. Hey, how you doing? You, yeah, you, you walked that way, okay? Good, good, good for you. Good for you, man. When the music is playing, it's a clear indication that he's still freaking around here. Why would the music away? It's just creeping me out at this stage. Okay, there, it's gone. Good. Okay. Hold on. Did I just do a complete circle? Hmm. I must have. Alrighty then. Ok, 
guess we're going to use that acid to burn the lock. Oh jeez, that didn't make another appearance. Excuse me. Holy shit, he's coming from nowhere. So what's the story now? Is he just going to come bursting through the door? Oh fuck, he is. Okay, we know what to do. We'll just uh, hide behind the pig here. Okay. We're safe, we're safe. He can't find us. Yeah, you piss off, please, yeah. Yeah, you, you go out that door. That's the best way to go. It's a win-win situation. Is he, is he completely gone now? No, just fucking, just fucking move. Ah, uh, not to wait the eternity for the music to stop playing. My screen is shaking. Ah, he almost got stuck in the carpet. That's fine. Okay, adios. Ah, oh, no. I was hoping. I was hoping it would be that door I'd have to go through. Oh no. Enough to go back up to greet Mr. Tons of Fun. Okay, so far so good. Here. Okay. All right, and I think I'll end this part after I go through this gate. Yes, this gate is a big deal. What? What do you mean it does no good, or it will do no good? What are you on about? By this event, it would do no good. What would do no good? It's acid. How will it not do any good? Uh, am I using it the wrong way? Come on, would you work? No. Ah, uh, freaking hell. There must be another door I missed or something. Although I can't think of what it could be. Because I've already been around here. I mean, um, there isn't anything else I'm missing, is there? I'll just do one more circle, then I'll call it a game. I've been up here, have I? Oh, I see. I see now. A little undiscovered area. It's in very poor condition. I suppose I'll have to go down this way. As well, to. Hey, you! Stop! Unlock this dialogue. You can't go outside! It's too dangerous! I'm telling Gabriel! I doubt that very much.
I'm gonna regret this, am I? Just, I'm, I probably need, need to go down here because there's probably a secret door. to differ. Okay, I know what to do here. Just uh, use the acid on the old lock. Then use my old chisel and hammer. Gets a snow white moon, and he couldn't help feeling sad for some reason. Holy shit, that was close! Sorry, I don't do the, I don't do the whole screaming routine. It's just uh, not something I do. So you use the drain sewers as a means of transport? Yes, they were built to divert water from an underground spring and are quite spacious. It seemed only natural to incorporate it into the overall structure. But we won't be using it. Not today. The flow is seasonal, and when the spring runs dry, the damp tunnels produce a rather poisonous type of fungi. There is an antidote, of course, but we won't be bothering with it today. Come, this way instead. We're almost there. Okay, you know what? It's been about 23 minutes. I said the video will be about 15 minutes, so I've gone way over my estimated time. So on that note, I will call this a game. Ah, just let me catch my breath. Whew. Man. I hope we don't see him again, although it's going to be inevitable. Anyway, until next time. See ya.